Hey guys, what's up? This is Boy on here with the Tactical Airsoft team, as usual. Um, probably say that a little too often, as you guys probably guessed. But, uh, let's get on into this video. Um, what it is, is it's going to be an update on my loadout and as well as my gun. Uh, as you can see, there's my plate carrier right there, and I will go be going over this, um, within later on in the video. But just to start things off, uh, no intro little, uh, clip today just because this is an update not a big fan of update videos but this one will definitely be worth your while as well as mine so uh... let's get straight on into this uh... before you know this video goes endless Okay, so let's see starting off i got my oe tech plate carrier with cummerbund um, you know i w and by the way in this video i'm just going to tell you what i'm going to put on it and uh... some things i can't really say because you know um... It the the we'll have big unboxing videos on those and stuff, but uh, okay. So so far right now I got my two sets of uh, double stack mag pouches which hold eight each. Uh, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, which is eight, right there. So I'm gonna be running eight mags on the right hand side. One stupid hand. Right there on the right hand side, I'm going to be running a um, what is it? A dump pouch, magazine uh, drop pouch, which it will be an ACU as well as pretty much everything on my vest. Um, just so you know, it can be a fluid motion uh, when I'm uh, shouldering my rifle and uh, when I want a quick reload because I am a BB waster. I'm just, I'll just say that, uh, but. I do it uh, very efficiently when I do use my BBs. Um, I'm not just a wasteful person and just buy like a $10 pack of BBs and just waste it within a day. No, I'm not like that, but whatever. You know, uh, it's always good to uh, have a dump pouch, as all airsofters would pretty much agree. Um, but on my left-hand side right there, I'm going to be running a, um, a little side, uh, what is it, utility pouch. Um, OE Tech Utility Pouch, ACU, just old maybe like a dead rag, some tools, just stuff like that. Um, as you can see, you, uh, within my loadout video, which we got a ton of loadouts that are coming up, just letting you guys know, so I'm uh, pretty sure you guys are excited about that. Um, but yeah, in my loadout video, you'll see how this all comes together and stuff. And uh, by the way, before I get a little bit more detailed, I have a um, Pantac Admin Pouch on back order as of right now. So, um, yeah, that will be going, of course, you know, right there. I also want an eye pouch, which will hold my phone, which will be off to a little bit to the right. And as you can see, right there, right there, that is my, uh, Grimlock, which will probably hold really anything. It's just there, just to be there, I guess. Um, but, you know, I'm going to, pretty soon, I'm going to be ordering a, what is it, a one-point sling, which is going to uh, harness uh, through my vest, which is going to be going through the right and left shoulder pads, uh, and I'm going to run it through that so the weight is not necessarily on me, but it's on more of the vest, which probably a whole bunch of YouTubers say that a lot, but uh, it turns out it actually is true, but yeah, so that's one thing, and on the back of my rig, I'm going to be running in uh Hydration carrier, ACU hydration carrier, with a 2.5 liter uh, bladder, and that should be that should be pretty nice. Uh, let's see what else. I'm also gonna get a drop leg holster. Um, of course, goes down my. Let's see, I'm probably gonna put it down my right thigh. Yeah, and uh, it's gonna have my pistol in it, which I don't have yet, but it's gonna be a secret. That's the one thing I'm not really gonna tell you about. Uh, so, you guys get a little suspense to this video, um, I guess, weird, but, um, yeah, so this is pretty much it, but, uh, you know, I'm also, let's see, I'm also gonna get a whole bunch of patches, like, uh, those will kind of be a surprise, you know, cause they're patches, not much of a big deal, but they're fun to look at, so, um, kind of define you as an airsoft player, I would say, I don't know, but, yeah, and I'm wearing full ACU except for my, sh I'm just going to wear a black Airsoft GI t-shirt, which I always wear, um, underneath all this because I live in Southern California and it's almost hot 
all the time or warm, I would say. Uh, it's just, at least sometimes in the winter, it gets to like 60 degrees, which uh, people in the uh, central United States or eastern United States, it's like freezing there. But we actually get pretty decent weather here, and I prefer wearing a uh, short sleeve shirt uh, out here. And, uh, cause I don't really need no BDU top, but I just wear, uh, BDU, uh, pants, as well as my, uh, boots. But I am planning on getting, like, arena flapjacks or whatever, uh, as well as a, what is it, um, Balkava, Balklava, uh, whatever it's called. Um, and, well, probably not one of those, uh, probably a smog or whatever to go over my mouth, uh, but that should be pretty nice, and maybe just a hat, a baseball cap uh, going backwards that holds like maybe one of my patches or whatever on it. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it with my best, I would say. I'm going to get like eight mag pouches to go across. I mean, eight mags to go in there with mag poles, of course. Uh, black mag poles, 556 five, NATO. Uh, which will be, which will make my loadout look really legit. Um, let's see. You know what, uh, let's get to my gun. Uh, still running the same thing. I'm still running my 9.6. Uh, still got my motor in there. Um, just got a new spring, so, you know, I might install that. Uh, or I might just keep it for backup. It's an M120, which would probably get me up to, like, 400, uh, you know, just in case if the FPS limit is a little bit higher in some places. But, yeah, um, I'm thinking about getting over there. I'm thinking about getting, like, an evike.com little, uh, what is it? What's it called? Uh, barrel extension? Uh, more like a mock suppressor or whatever. Pretty much the same thing, you know. But, uh, yeah, I might be putting one of those on because I hate orange tips, but it takes bloody good long time to take that one off, I would say. But, yeah, I might even be running P-Mags in here, I don't know. P-Mags or E-Mags, or just standard, uh, 60 round mid-caps, or 130, or 30, who knows. But that'll all come with Christmas and stuff, but, uh, yeah, this should be a pretty good loadout. And, uh, future upgrades for my gun, I would probably say... Of course, the barrel extension, um, maybe a new, uh, maybe a new motor, I would say, I don't know, or, um, maybe try running a higher LiPo in it, maybe like an 11.1, that might be pretty cool. You guys, uh, leave, if, if you guys have any suggestions on maybe what I should get, leave a comment in the description below, right down there, uh, but that should be, uh, probably wrap, wrap up this video, probably one of my longest videos, 8.12, 8.13, 8.14, you know, uh, well, at least that's on my camera, not counting the intro, but, uh, so far, uh, I really like my loadout, and I really like where it's going, um, but, yeah, I just, for the, while, while I'm still here, let me bring it over here very quick, there is uh, Kyle's Char 21 right here. I just got it. I just fixed it. I just installed a new spring in it because he doesn't really trust himself with airsoft and installing stuff in his airsoft gun. But yeah, there's his holographic sights, 552, uh, and everything like that, you know. Um, but yeah, I just got in, in, done installing that spring. It's really easy. All you really need to do is open up the butt plate and just uh, get a small Allen key. Or uh, no, you unscrew this little plate and you get a small Allen key. Then you twist it, and then just your spring guide and spring comes out, which is pretty cool. But, yeah. Uh, so, thank you all for watching. Talk to yourself to YouTube videos. Sorry for such a long vid, but I hope it was worth your while. Uh, and I will see you guys all later. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment. Um, as well as request, uh, um, what is it, future purchases for my loadout. ACU. Rem yeah, just remember it's ACU. I'll just say that. But... Uh, for the third time, I would say. Thank you all for watching Tech Blur Soft YouTube videos. Peace out, subscribe, rate, and goodbye.